All right, I ain't gonna take no more of your time. We got a great show for you guys, man. Show some love, and we can bring out your host for the night. This is my man, he cool as shit. Show some love, give it up for Duke Michaels, ladies and gentlemen. He's your host for the night, give it up. Appreciate it. Without further ado, let's bring up your first act. She's a comedian. Her name is Miss Lipton. Make some motherfucking noise, y'all. Sometimes I pee when I cough. When I sneeze. When I check my mail. My email. And it happens all the time when I do stand-up comedy. <laughs> and, and I'm so afraid that I'm going to get attacked sometime. I, I piss all over the attacker. Yeah. He think I was kinky. <laughs> jeez, you put it on Facebook or Twitter, you know, I mean, jeez. <laughs> it's very humiliating. But you know something, it's a, very, it's a very common thing after childbirth. And I gave birth to three. At once. Yes, I'm the proud mother of triplets. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, I was five foot three in both directions. <laughs> When I would tell people, yeah, I have triplets, they'd say, and you're still sane? I said, I fooled you. <laughs> yes, uh, they're 25 years old now. No one asked, but that's okay. Yeah, and uh, two, uh, I have a son, wonderful boy, and two bitches. <laughs> they earned their title, believe me. My son never had to put him into timeout, never. 
Good boy. The girls, you put them into time out. Go to your room, they go jumping out the window. We'd have to go look through the neighborhood, look for them. What can I say? So now, the girls are living in El Cajon. One of them got a wonderful, you didn't ask, but it's okay, I'll just tell you. Got a nice job as a manager of Fredericks of Hollywood. And the other one teaches pole dancing. <laughs> teaches. So a friend of mine, very straight-laced person, she says, pole dancing, what is that, like folk dancing? I said, oh yeah, it's Polish. <laughs> got out of that one. <laughs> So I like to go shopping with my girls, and, and they like to go shopping with me, especially on Tuesdays, because Ross has 55 plus, 10% off, you know? <laughs> they'll call me, they'll have a whole thing, a shopping cart full of stuff. Mom, can you come? We've got a, a yeah, anyway, forget that. So anyhow, sometimes I go into the Forever 21 by myself, and I hear giggles from the sales clerks. They think, what, what's so funny? I'm in here, so what? If the sequin fits, I'll wear it. <laughs> So yeah, <laughs> um, yeah. I kind of call it Forever 61, what can I say? <laughs> What's a number anyway, you know? <laughs> I've even asked them, do you give a senior discount? You look at me like I'm nuts. I said, well, you know, Ross does, Salvation Army does. Yes, so I support the troops. Shopping at Salvation Army, Old Navy, you know. I even bought myself a camouflage skirt. Had a hell of a time, though, trying to find a top. <laughs> Camouflage, yeah. Okay, keep up, keep up. <laughs> so dating, you're wondering. I'm divorced, happily, yeah. Dating, oh, they. I'll tell you, I started dating back in the 60s. Now I'm dating in my 60s. <laughs> Go figure, it's not easy, I'll tell you. I tried the online dating. It's more like out of line dating, you know, with the plenty of fish. I mean, who the fuck wants a fish? <laughs> I want a man. <laughs> so this guy, okay, I met a guy, retired Navy SEAL. Now he looks like a freaking walrus. But <laughs> he invited me over to his house. <laughs> It's all true. It's very, with a long freaking mustache. It looks like boys. So he invites me over to his, his apartment. We had already gone out public a few times. So yeah, his apartment. For dinner, I thought, oh, what a nice touch. Romantic. He made me a tuna fish sandwich. I said, what? No pickle? He goes, ah, oh, you want a pickle? Crazy guy, what the heck? I'm not that kind of a woman. Years ago, maybe in the 60s, not in my 60s. <laughs> yeah, like the pole dancing, the pole dancing daughter, I was a go-go girl. Of course, it's gone now, but I was a go-go girl, yes. Have any of you heard of that new thing, that twerking? Is that crazy? If you haven't heard of twerking, have you heard of twerking? You gotta go on YouTube and look at these films. Oh my God. It even makes a noise. Oh. The noise! It's like they've got batteries in their cheeks of their tush. I don't know how they do it, I'll tell you. I tried it. My back went out. I didn't go out. My back went out. Jeez, I tell you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I didn't go out. The last date that I had was sprinkled on my granola. <laughs> sad. Very sad. And, and my memory's going. You know, when you get older, this is what happens to us. I mean, I'm going to depress all of you. I don't want to depress you. This is laughter. This is a night of laughter. And, and, and joy, and all that kind of stuff, because laughter is the best medicine. Yeah. And I'm a drug dealer. <laughs> I love it, I love it. <laughs> so with the memory, I was gonna take a class, in a six week class, and how to improve your memory. And it wasn't too expensive. The thing is, I forgot where I saw it advertised. So I can't go now. It's all right, it's okay. Um, and my friends are always telling me, Mindy, you know, sometimes you get off the track. You, you need to focus. I tried those focus pills, you know, focus factor. I tried the focus drinks. I even bought a Ford Focus. <laughs> it was so hot out today. 
that I drove around with my top down. I don't have a convertible. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, yes. <laughs> oh, yay, yay. Uh, so I'll go back, back to the online dating thing. I could do that, yes. So you know what I do? I just shoot from the hip, you know, because I'm not going to have these very much longer, you know? <laughs> All those hip replacement things you hear about. So, um, uh, what was I? Well, see, now I forgot because I talked about the whole memory thing. <laughs> oh, I bought myself a memory foam mattress so that I'd remember the guy's name that I slept with. <laughs> she'd come into my life already. Wow. <laughs> it's going to happen in June. I read my horoscope. It said to take a rest for March, April, and May. I'm resting. I'm resting. It'll happen. It'll happen. It's in the stars. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Yeah. So my son, he was going here to SDSU, and then he decided uh, he wanted to study abroad. So he moved back home to Redding, California and moved in with his girlfriend. <laughs> it wasn't funny. <laughs> Study abroad. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> I'm sorry, that usually gets a, a very good laugh. It's a <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I love it. I love it. Isn't it great? You know, it, it helps your blood pressure. In fact, I just retired. <laughs> yes, I did. And that does not mean that you're tired again. I don't know what the... But anyway, I knew I had to get out of that place, that job. So I retired. Fancy word for getting out, getting, getting the hell out. Getting away from that supervisor. Anyway, because I figured the last race that I had was in my blood pressure. <laughs> so it, it, was, it was time to move on. So yes, and my therapist, my therapist discharged me. He said, Mindy, you're great, you're fine now. You're telling me jokes, you're entertaining me. I don't need to, pay, you, know, you, know, you don't need to pay me anymore because no more stress. I'm living stress-free. Isn't that amazing? Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Yes, oh gosh, yeah, it's, it's the only way. Um, so what else? Um, so nobody's married here. Is that true? Nobody's married? Wow. Uh, <laughs> okay, well, all right, how many are single? Let's hear for single. Or clap for single. Great. All right, how many are happily single? Just this part. Yeah, yeah. It's got its ups and downs, you know? I mean, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'll tell you something. I tried depression. It just didn't work for me. <laughs> Yeah, really. <laughs> so yeah, I'm so glad you guys are all out here tonight. <laughs> well, that, that's not funny. <laughs> Although maybe it is because if you weren't out here, I'd be talking to chairs and candles. <laughs> and they don't even laugh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but I'll tell you something. I beat myself up all the time. When I was working, people at work, they would say to me, Mindy, What's happening? Where, what's all those bruises? Where are your bruises coming from? It was a vicious cycle. Send myself flowers. Tell myself I'm sorry. And it, I know I should leave. Me. And one of these days, I'm just going to have to turn myself into elder abuse. <laughs> Well, thank you all. Gosh, I'm Mindy Lipton. He just said Miss Lipton. Mindy Lipton, send me on Facebook. Thank you so much. You're a great audience. Thank you. Now I'm going to sleep. <laughs>